Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. So let's get into it, Taurus. Thank you, God, for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so we're going to start with love. Let's see what's going on in love for Taurus. All right. Okay, somebody could re be remembering the fun times with you right now. It would be like an open relationship, a third-party situation. If you did engage with them or if they engaged with you, there was somebody who was wanting to date you, I'm um, sorry, exclusively. Uh, I don't know what happened. Let's see. What's going on for Taurus? Money, 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 money. You got to make money, honey. Uh, you got to give me gifts. Take me on trips to be with me. Somebody could be gossiping about um, all of the money that you're making, the gifts that you're getting. Um, maybe you've got some man here. Maybe you deal with athletes or somebody who's in the limelight, has nice cars, nice things. They get a lot of attention because of these nice things that they have. There's some type of relationship that you have with this person, maybe even a family. But again, there is an open relationship or this person is already married and you are the um, third party to this situation here. Um, it, it is beneficial for you because you're getting money and gifts. People could be talking about the relationship or this person could be you know, pillow talking with you saying that they're going to get a divorce or that they're, you know, they're upset with their counterpart and they want out of this connection, but it could just be talk. They could feel like this relationship is just sex or this, how you feel about it. Especially if you are the other woman, you feel like, you know, it's karmic, it's going nowhere and it's for the short term. Yeah. It looks like the universe will play a part in this here. Um, and put, maybe even put a stop to this. Cause I'm feeling like it says stop. Um, some of you just going to get back out there on your own platforms um, and just be the beauty queen and just get all of the attention, the praise, the whatever you can get because you're living life to, you know, the fullest. And it looks like you get a lot of communication, especially on whatever platform you are on. Um, take some wise advice if you do run across some advice here. Okay. Let's see what the future holds for you in love. What's the future energy for Taurus? Distant horizons. So learning lessons, maybe the spiritual component of why you met, why you're engaging, why you're doing this, why this, um, that will come into you. You know, you'll start to understand the reasons why, and maybe you might even get to a place of asking yourself why here in the distance, distant horizon. Also some wish fulfillment, not now, but in the distant horizon could happen for you. Especially if some of you want to come out of an impoverished state of being. Now that could be in terms of money, but this also could be energetically in terms of I want to come out of being the side chick or the side dude or, or whatnot, or I don't always want to be in that position. You know, maybe you're going to start asking the questions of why, and you know, why aren't people taking you serious or why are you not dealing with people who would take you serious? You know, it looks like because some of you are expecting more or you want more, you're in a place of expectation. You're giving so much and maybe getting so little or what could be, you know, maybe some people look at as a lot, but you feel like it's little because you want maybe love, you want devotion, you want a real relationship, you want a family, you want something out in the open. And maybe somebody is at a place of where they can only give you passion um, because they have a family. They can only give you a third party situation because they already have obligation elsewhere. Okay. All right. So let's see what's going on for you in terms of career and finance. Career and finance. Career. Okay. The cards don't want to talk. It must be that good, right? The hangman. All right. So you're taking a step back, maybe looking at something from a different perspective. How can I tweak this? How can I make it better? What do I need to do? And uh, maybe even you're getting different opinion, um, but you're also definitely shifting your perspective. And you're also asking the questions of why, why am I not getting 
the sales, the profits, the the views, the whatever. Um, you also could be trying to gain knowledge of so that you can make those changes. Yeah, you're trying to come out of this impoverished state. Why you're not, you know, seeing the numbers, something about numbers that you want to see in terms of maybe your business, in terms of what you're doing or you're presenting to the world. Yeah, especially if you're a business owner, self-employed. You're expending so much energy and you're you're not understanding why it's not being it's under something that's undervalued. Wow, as I said, six of pentacles. You're putting out so much and you're not getting, you know, you're getting but so much, or you're not getting enough, or you feel like you're not getting paid enough. Especially when you put it out to the world, when people look for it, they look up to it, they look at it. Something that has you in a pigeonhole with the eight of swords here, you feel like um you're in a roundabout. You feel stuck or something. You feel like something is stagnant. The Queen of Cups, you you might have to look at your presentation and listen to those psychic thoughts, those that intuition that's telling you to shift, change, move. Look at perspective or, or get a new perspective of. Show more of yourself. I'm hearing that there are layers to you. Yeah. That's what I have for you, Taurus. I hope that it resonates for you. If it does, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Keep in mind, you can get your own personal reading at the website level. The website is linked below. Also, I am live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Also, you can learn the tarot with me. Yep, you could take classes with me. Our first class starts December 27th. Excited about that. So come learn with us. Uh, also, if you're in the giving spirit, which you should be, the Amazon link uh, the Amazon wish link is the Amazon wish list link is below. Okay. <laughs> uh, take advantage if you're feeling moved to do so. It's all items that would be used for the channel. So it's not, you're not going to be buying me an air fryer, you know, so, I don't know. Just want somebody to know that. Uh, also, if you have a question or two, you could text your question to the number below. Receive the answer to your question all on your mobile device. Take advantage of that, guys. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.